In this surveillance video, an argument over a handicapped parking spot turned deadly. He was just trying to protect us. 28-year-old Marquise McLaughlin, who's black, went into the store to buy snacks for his kids. That's when Michael Draycott, who's white, confronted McLaughlin's girlfriend, Brittany Jacobs, while she sat in the car. Jacobs says McLaughlin came to her defense, shoving Draycott to the ground. Draycott pulled a gun and shot the unarmed father of three. He felt after being slammed to the ground that the next thing was is that he was going to be further attacked. Draycott, who has a permit to carry a concealed weapon, was not arrested or charged because of Florida's controversial Stand Your Ground law, which gives people in Florida the right to protect themselves using deadly force. If this were to happen in a state that did not have Stand Your Ground laws, I believe that the shooter would have would already be arrested and would be going to trial for murder. Stand Your Ground became part of a national conversation after George Zimmerman killed an unarmed black teenager, Trayvon Martin, in 2012. Zimmerman was acquitted of murder. As protesters demand action against Draca, friends and family grieve. I clearly don't think that it's right that you can literally gun someone down. Ten hours later, you walk in the street. It's not right. The video now in the hands of the state's attorney's office to determine if the controversial law in this case will stand. Tammy Leitner, NBC News, Clearwater, Florida. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.